Australian teen rugby player given 10-year ban for assaulting referee in under-19s grand final. Australian teen rugby player given 10-year ban for assaulting referee in under-19s grand final Australian teen Mark Mefua has received a 10-year ban for striking referee Nicholas Gall during the Newcastle and Hunter Rugby Union under-19s grand final. A rugby player in Australia has received a 10-year ban for striking a referee during the Newcastle and Hunter Rugby Union under-19s grand final at the weekend. Video footage shows Maitland Black's breakaway Mark Mefua, 18, forcefully shoving Nicholas Gall, 19, during Maitland's 28-3 loss to the Newcastle Wanderers in the NSW Hunter region on Saturday night. A few moments earlier. Mefua had been involved in a scuffle after the Maitland players objected to a dangerous lifting tackle by the Wanderers. Mark Mefua, left, allegedly lashes out at referee Nicholas Gall, right. Gall was in the process of issuing Mefua with a red card, when Mefua struck him with what is believed to be an open hand. He was arrested at his home in Rutherford on Saturday night and charged with common assault. He will face Maitland local court on October 4. The crowd reacts after referee Nicholas Gall was allegedly struck by a player. During a two-hour NHRU judiciary hearing on Wednesday night, Mefuo pleaded guilty to lashing out at Gall. However, despite his regret, the judiciary deemed the act unacceptable and at the top end under Australian rugby union guidelines. As well as the suspension for physical abuse of an official Mefua was found guilty of the red card offence, striking with his elbow dash and was issued a 10-match ban for that. Nicholas Gall, left, who was allegedly assaulted during an under-19s grand final, is seen here refereeing a game last year. Both sentences are to be served concurrently. Gall, who did not appear at the hearing, was not seriously hurt. Mefua was set to receive the Jack Scott medal, presented to the best and fairest player in the under-19s competition, but is now ineligible. The incident shocked and outraged the hundreds gathered at the ground and drew widespread condemnation on social media, but NHRU officials stressed that, while Mefua's actions were unacceptable, they had a duty of care to look after him during the process. We have not seen anything like this in our zone in 30 years, NHRU general manager Randy Fairfull said. It is unacceptable to verbally or physically abuse a referee. The sanctions show that if you undertake that behavior, you will be out of the game for a serious amount of time. But, as well as ensuring Nick's well-being, the union has an obligation to provide Mark with the appropriate support. Within that 10 years, the Referees Association and Mayland Club will work the young man to assist in some rehabilitation. Mefua has until close of business on Friday to appeal against the sentence.